This is Showtime Sean Porter. Exactly. This is Earl Spin Jr. Hey everyone, this is Jesse Vargas. And you're watching True School Sports. You're watching True School Sports. Right. And you're watching True School Sports. Stay tuned. Yeah, crazy time we live in. Yeah, it's crazy time. Well, it's good that you know you 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 found a, an outlet to kind of just you know stay busy and, and, and actually like you know express yourself. Cause a lot of people don't have that. A lot of people don't have a talent in life. Yeah. Yeah. What about um you know they say like fighters a lot. Every fighter has his motivation. Every fighter has a goal. Every fighter has a reason that they fight. What is yeah. your reason that you box? My reason that I box was because well that's a good question. <laughs> My reason is because I would just wanna. I just want to make myself a name. Just be somebody. I want to be like that floor me out there with money and all that stuff. I just want to be next floor me like that. So okay, you mentioned you mentioned like Floyd like five times, but so yeah. I already knew when I first saw you fight yeah. that you were some you were a Floyd Mayweather fan. You were yeah. influenced by him. I'm a very big Floyd Mayweather fan. I know, and I know like on my phone I, when I saved your number on my phone, I actually have you saved as, as a little Floyd because you just reminded yeah. me how you, how you hold your um, your right hand real close and just yeah. how you throw it reminded me of Floyd. Um, what about Floyd specifically? You know, growing up drew you to him um, yeah, as a as a fan as a fighter. Well, Floyd Mayweather he was very dedicated to his sport so that I, I'm learning stuff from him like stuff he did I want to do the same thing he did I want to be fighting big money fights driving in there, um, private jets living in a big mansion that's what the type of life I want to live you want to live lavishly yeah okay I want to take care of my family make sure my mom my dad do not worry about um, being poor anymore and I want to take care of them Okay. Yeah. Nah, I admire that. Uh, if if you could if you could say one thing to Floyd Mayweather right now, because you know sometimes I put out these videos yeah. and I get fighters to watch. I don't know who watches these, but more yeah. people, they want more people, more fighters watch than I think. Okay. So if Floyd somehow comes across as, what is something you would say to him right now? I'll say that. Well, he was a very good fighter. Well, he was kind of arrogant when he was coming up, but <laughs> <laughs> when he got older, he started getting humble and he. He um surrounded with the right he was surrounded with the right people around him. That's why he became the best. He was around positive people and he took care of his people and did what he had to do. And he trained hard, stayed humble, and when it is when it was his time he just went for it. Yeah. Yeah. So that's what it is. Um you know, Floyd, I mean, you obviously have been in a lot of boxing gyms, you sparred a lot yeah. of pros, I've you know, done my research. Uh what's the hardest thing uh, you personally have went through in the sport of boxing at your, your young age. The hardest thing I went through was when I, was, when I went to the, um, the National Civil Gloves. Like, kids up there, talented. Kids up there, New Jersey, New York, just they had a different level because up where they're from, it's not about it's nothing but boxing. So yeah, yeah. They had that boxing background, so they they get taught real, real, and like I saw some of talent. It was amazing. I saw a little kids, Pee Wee. I saw them fighting like they all, like Floyd Mayweather already. <laughs> with the slipping, ducking, chin tuck, like elbows in. Like, the, the fundamentals were just yeah, there. It just perfect. Yeah, like some kid named Lil Future, Jameer, mm -hmm. Ro Jameer Robinson, something like that. Okay. He's a, that's an amazing kid. He's a good fighter. For his age. Wait, how old is he? He's like 11, I think, 12. For his age. He's, he's he's an amazing fighter. He's from New York or Jersey or something I like think that. He's from yeah, he's from Jersey, I think. Okay. He's he's from up there though. But you're just saying like the fundamentals that these kids yeah. saw, you were just impressed. Yeah, I was impressed. I was like, wow. And he probably went to the gym, and you were like, yeah. I I got I got to get right. Yeah. Myself.